Shalom to the nation of Israel. Before we get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukhah HaKadosh. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom, right? So this your brother Shopper, man. So, you know, I was I did something, a lesson on this a while ago. So, you know, they like to talk about how we were savages and they, they gave us, they brought civilization to the native savages here and us, the one that got us from Africa and brought us over here and they gave us. So that's not the case, man. When they came here, they was, they was, they was searching for money and gold and everything like that. They did not know how to farm the land or nothing like that. They were eating each other here in America. When they fight, they was eating each other here in America. Jamestown, colonists resort to cannibalism. Yeah. Archaeologists have discovered the first physical evidence of cannibalism by desperate English colonists driven by hunger during the starvation time of 1609 to 1610 in Jamestown, Virginia. So think about it. They came here. They, they they so busy trying to steal land and, and getting in the fights with the Native Americans, killing them off, um, Northern Kingdom. Northern Kingdom saved them from cannibalism. The announcement was made by the team of researchers. So you can't say this us being racist. This is them. Look, the Smithsonian Museum of Natural, Natural History, Historic Jamestown. I bet they won't teach you this in history. About the, the 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 time when they was resorted to cannibalism here in America before they learned how to farm and the Native Americans taught them how to um get certain things herbs and this and this and that and all that to survive. They won't tell you about that. There are five historical accounts written by or about Jamestown colonists that reference cannibalism. So you know they oh it just happened a couple of times. No, it was going on, man. It was going on for a few years, man. Colonists that reference cannibalism, but this is the first time that it's been proven. See, so it's been proven that they were eating people here in America. Make America great again. We'll go back to the time when y'all was eating each other. That's what time we gonna go back to. Look, portions of the butcher's skull and skin shin bone of a 14-year-old girl from England, dubbed Jane by researchers, were unearthed by Jamestown uh, archaeologists last year. They found the remains about 2.5 feet, 0 0.8 meters down in the Savaba trash deposit in the cellar of a building built in 1608. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Since the excavation of James Fort began in 1994, the discovery is second only to the, the discovery is second only to the discovery of the fort he added. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The findings answered a long-standing question among historians about the occurrence of cannibalism. Yeah, they was eating people. It's what they was doing. This is what they was doing. When about 80% of colonists died, they was even the, the I, I was watching the elder bishops out of Connecticut, that one of the, the, one of the bishops was saying that they even was digging up, you know, you die, they dig you up and eat you. Describe multiple chop and cut marks on a girl's skull that were made by one or more assailants after she died. They were clearly inter interested in cheek meat. Muscles of the face, tongue, and brain. Look at these heads. That where they get that um. That's where they get that um. What's the name from? The um. You know the um. The um. Walking Dead shit, and they be eating the brains and all. That's where they get this shit from, man. This is where they get that they was doing this shit here in America, here in America. But then a turn around and you savages, you red savages. and then, No, no, no. They are the savages. 
one of the foremost forensic anthropologists in the world, has analyzed numerous skeletal remains of prehistoric people who were victims of cannibalism. This is their hit. This is what they was doing, man. This is what this is what they was doing up in the caves when they sleeping with the dogs. Yeah, man. Let's get some. Let's get some scriptures, man. <laughs> let's get some scriptures. We gonna go back to these pictures. Let's get some. Salaki, let's get some scriptures. Let's get some scriptures. <laughs> He saw the caveman cannibal. <laughs> he saw the caveman cannibal. Job chapter 30 verse 1. But now that they are younger than I have me in derision. And that young is not young in age. Young as far as they not on the level. They not on the level of us, man. They, they, you know, the, 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 the Lord chose Israel to be a um a special people. We the salt of the earth. So everybody everybody else is up under us, man. Period. Whose fathers I would not would have disdained to have set with the dogs of my flock. Now let me show you this. Let me show you this one real quick. Let's go to this one real quick. Why the why 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 they said that about East the Edomites? Let's get let's get this real quick. Let's get this real quick. Community. Let's get it real quick. This this is this is dumb. This is their culture. This is Edomite culture, man. This is what we doing. We exposing Edomite culture, man. Dang, they took the Chicago camp down? Wow, see? This truth hurting, man. This truth is hurting. This truth is hurting. They said, they said, they said some, they said some things about the, <laughs> the, the, the vaccine a couple of times. Where is it at? Let's get it. Where is it at? Where is it at? Look, took another video down. They be taking our lessons down. But y'all will say we ain't got the truth. But we ain't got the truth. Where is it at? Where is it at? I know it's here. I put it up here in a thing, in a comic board. So lock it, bear with me, bear with me, please, bear with me. Dang, it ain't here? What, they done took it down? Oh, here it go, right here, I passed it. There it go, right there, look. This is why they said, this is why they said, don't leave them with your animals. Because they'll do your animals. This is what Esau will do. Esau will do your animals. Horse, dog, donkey, chicken. They don't care. They don't care. This is why the scriptures say this. Let's get back to it. But now, they that are younger than I have been in derision whose fathers I would have disdained to have set with the dogs of my flock. Yeah, because they do your dogs. Yea, where to might the strength of their hands profit me, in whom old age was perished, for, for want and famine they were solitary, fleeing into the wilderness, in former times desolate and waste. Yeah, they was ran up into the caves. Let's get this one. Obadiah. Let's get this one. Obadiah. One. Now, now this is the vision. The vision of Obadiah does save the Lord power concerning Edom, right? We have heard a rumor from the, the Lord, and an ambassador is sent among the heathen. Arise ye and let us rise up against her battle. Now watch this. Four. The pride of thine heart have deceived thee. Thou that dwellest in the clefts of the rocks. They was chased from whose habitation is high. That saith in his heart. Who shall bring me down to the ground? Let's get back to it now. Whose habitation is in. They was chased from society. So they was went up in the, in the caves. King David. King David was on their ass man. <laughs> King David was on their ass. Job, Job 4 and, and 30, who cut up, who cut up marshes 
by the bushes and juniper roots for their meat. They were driven forth from among men. See, that's why they was up in the clefts of the rocks. Watch, there, you see it right here, watch. They cried after them as after a thief to dwell in the cliffs of the valleys in caves of the earth and in the rocks. See, let's talk about Esau right here. Among the bushes they braid, under the nettles they were gathered together. They were children of fools, yea, children of base men. They were viler than the earth, yea. This is who it, This is who they are, man. This is who they are. Let's get them pictures now. Let, now let's get to the pictures. Let's get to the pictures now. They know. Look, see? Cannibalism found in Jamestown, the Washington Post. They know. They know. The starving time. Many of these settlers unaccustomed to work, unaccustomed to work, Oh, we are hard working, and this descendants, and, and we made America great. No, the frick they didn't. Didn't plan for such harsh winters. Too much time spent searching for gold and minerals. Yeah, they worrying about um riches, getting rich. Couldn't even eat. Winter of 1609 to 10, the starving time. Archaeologists archaeologists have found evidence that the colonists ate cats, dogs, horses, and rats, including the black rat, carrier of the bubonic plague. Yeah, they was eating anything, man. 16, 1609, 600 new colonists, boom, 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 6, 610, only 60 survived, some accounts of cannibalism, Sharp prick of hunger which no man can truly describe, but he who have tasted the bitterness thereof. Eh. 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 Straight, straight cannibals. Straight cannibals. Straight cannibals. This is their history. CRT. Well, which, which paper is this? Eh. Skulls show starving settlers turn to cannibalism. Yup. Yup. <laughs> they won't tell you about that in history, though. They want to tell you all of the great things the so-called white man did. Let's talk about the early years of Jamestown, man. Let's get a couple more scriptures, man. We going to close out, man. Yeah, I ain't want to make this long, man. I, it just was all my spirit. Like, yo, they talk all this shit about who, what they did and all of this and this and that. They all, they going to forever leave out the bad stuff. Just like the Dark Ages did say the Dark Ages was all these millions of years ago. No, it wasn't. They was ran up into the caves from 300 AD until 13, the middle of 13, the beginning of 1400 AD. Which ain't nothing but what? 600 and something odd years ago? They, they was ran up into the mountains. And Jake, dark-skinned people was ruling E, um, not E, um, Slaki, not Egypt, Europe. That was dark. The the um Vikings, those was dark-skinned people. All of this stuff. That's why they had the Renaissance era, the rebirth, the rebirth of who, the rebirth of the Edomites. That's when they came down, and from the fourth, late, the early fourteen hundreds, they started to take over. They ain't gonna tell you about that history, man. Daniel 14, 4 and 7. This man is by decree of the watches and the demand by the word of the holy ones to the intent that the, the living may know that the most high ruleth in the kingdom of men and giveth it to whosoever he will and set up, up over it the basis of men. Yeah, Esau going back to Job. Job 30th chapter, which goes back to get you to um, Obadiah. Clef, dwell in the clefts of the rocks. These are these are the people that's over us, man. These people are over us. But, but, their time is coming. Their time is coming. Psalms chapter 49 and 10. There's a couple more. I ain't going to make this too long. It ain't got to be too long. Psalms 49 and 10. For he seeketh that wise men die, likewise the fool and the brutish person perish, and leave their wealth to others. Their inward thought is that their houses 
shall continue forever in their dwelling places to all generation. They call their lands after their own names. Yeah. We in America. It was named after Amerigo Vespucci. Amerigo Vespucci. Africano Sipicanus, or however you say his name. This is the Asia even named after Edomite. All of the streets. Oh, they gave, oh, they gave us Martin Luther King Drive. Shut the hell up, Jake. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> even that name, Martin Luther King. That's still the Edomite name. That's not the, that's not the name that the, our, our ancestors over in Jerusalem would have been calling themselves. But whatever. Jake don't get it. Let's keep getting it. Job 14. Yeah, this is who is over us. Job 14 and 4. Who can bring a clean thing out of an unclean? Not one. Seeing his days are determined. The number of his months are with thee. Thou has appointed his bounds that he cannot pass. No, he can't he cannot pass. He can't get around him. His time is limited, man. His time is limited. His time is limited. Let's get this one. Let's get Malachi. His time is limited. Matter of fact, let's get Isaiah first. 14 and 15, 16. They that see him, they that see thee, shall narrowly look upon thee and consider, consider thee, saying, Is this the man? Is this the man, the cave beast? Is this the man that made the earth to tremble? That did shake kingdoms? That made the whole, that made the world as a wilderness and destroyed the cities thereof? That opened not the house of his prisoners? Is this the man? That's what we're going to say. Once we realize that we had a damn caveman over us, man. All the kings of the nations, even all of them, lie in glory. Everyone in his own house. Yeah. Let's go down. Let's go 22, 21. Pre yeah, prepare slaughter for his children, for the inequity of their fathers, that they do not rise, nor possess the land, nor fill the face of the world with cities. For I will rise up against them, saith the Lord of hosts, and cut off from them, from Babylon, the name and remnant and son and nephew, saith the Lord. Now remember that. Now remember this, because you're going to see this again. And cut off from Babylon the name and the remnant and the son and the nephew, saith the Lord. Right? Okay. Now let's get on. Let's move on. You're going to hear that again, though. Watch. You're going to hear that again. I got a scripture that match up with that. Let's get Malachi, though. Let's get that one first. Malachi 1 and 4. Malachi 1 and 4. Whereas Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate places. That's what they did. The Renaissance ever, right? Thus saith the Lord of hosts, they shall build, but I will throw down. And they shall call them the border of wickedness. And the people against whom the Lord have indignation forever. Yep. Yep. The Lord got indignation with them forever. Now let's get it. Now remember what we said. Now let's go back to Job. Job 18. eighteen four and 5. And we're going to jump down. Watch. Job chapter 18. He tareth himself in his anger, and shall the earth be forsaken for thee, and shall the rock be removed out of his place? Yea, the light of the wicked shall be put out. We just said the border of wickedness, right? Edom as the border of wickedness. Yea, the light of the wicked shall be put out, and the spark of his fire shall not shine. Let's jump down. Ten. The snare is laid for him in the ground, and a trap for him in the way. Terrors shall make him afraid on every side, and shall drive him to his feet. Right? Let's get down. Let's go down. Fourteen. His confidence shall be rooted out 
of his tabernacles. We talk about the pride, right? The pride, his confidence in Obadiah, his confidence shall be rooted out of his tabernacle and he shall bring him to the king of terrors, the Lord going to do, do some wicked to him. It shall, it shall dwell in his tabernacle because it is none of his brimstone shall be scattered upon his habitation, his roots. Now listen to this, his roots shall be dried up beneath and above shall his branch be cut off. His remembrance shall perish from the earth, and he shall have no name in the street. He shall be driven from the light into darkness and chased out of the world. Watch this one. He shall neither have son nor nephew among his people, nor any remaining in his dwelling. They that come after him shall be astonished at his day. Is this the man? Is this the man <laughs> in the kingdom? Uh, Lord, Lord, um, Grandpa, um, Sire, my Lord, you, you serious? The Edomites was running the world? <laughs> they that come after him shall be astonished at his day, as they that went before are affrighted. Surely such are the dwellings of the wicked, and this is the place of him that knoweth not the most high. Yeah. So they gonna be up out of here, man. Like I said, man, they wanna they in school, they wanna talk stuff. They ain't gonna tell you about the starving time. Look, still they eating each other, but they still fighting the Native Americans, and then Jake turned around and helped them, helped them to survive. Look, 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 here it go right here. Look, let's see what I was saying. Settlers ate dogs, cats, and horses. Fresh graves were robbed for food. One man murdered his wife to eat her. <laughs> man, the point is proven. So, yeah, so with that one, man, we going to close out. We going to say all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakak Kadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. Peace to the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, Temple of King David. Men, women, children, the elect, Shalom, stay spiritual out there, Kwam Yashirala, and the Bible Bible. Barakatham, family. Shalom.